Good morning, artists. We're talking about masks, and the assignment that you have is to create a real or symbolic mask out of any materials that you want, and to show something that may not be readily visible on the outside to people, but to show, um, like Marcos Raya did, maybe from the inside of your experience. So this can be a real or metaphoric. But we've been talking a lot of masks, a lot about masks recently because of the pandemic. And that's a really interesting additional layer to this project. So you can absolutely explore and think about what masks mean right now in our world where we're having this global pandemic. And masks have really become uh, politicized where um, some people are wearing them, some people aren't wearing them. People are saying, make sure you wear your mask. There's a big sign even down there on the rail trail saying you have to wear a mask. Um, some people are upset about this. And we have expectations right here at our school right now about wearing masks. Um, and uh, But traditionally, there's a rich history in different cultures all over the world that have rich traditions of making and wearing masks. In general, masks have two important functions. They provide a disguise for the wearer, um, and in many cultures, they allow the wearer to assume the identity, at least temporarily, of some other person or being. So watch the little video that I'm attaching to the lesson today, which is a trailer for a longer movie I used to, I used to show in my classroom. Um, I only have it in VHS, which is the, the old, uh, not, a, not a CD. You, I don't know if you've ever seen those before. There's an actual tape inside of a VHS video that played in a VCR. But um, watch the trailer and think about all the possibilities visually and metaphorically for the mask. And you get to interpret this project and use the materials you want to use. I also will point out that in the announcements for today, um, you guys can work on this project today and it's really due on Friday, but if you need an extension, I'm fine with it. I'll have 250 masks and uh, Artsonia projects to get through. And so if you need to work on it at home over the weekend where you can set up your own workspace, I'm fine with that. Um, you don't even need to email me unless you can't finish it over the weekend. I'd like to, to start a new project on Monday and don't want you to get behind on this. So I can't wait to see what you're going to do and I'll be in the Zoom room if you have any questions um, today and on Friday.